Welcome everyone, Pro here to my Let's Play of Fire Emblem 7, The Blazing Blade. Or just Fire Emblem for all of us outside of Japan. <laughs> yeah, I've been looking forward to playing this one the most out of all, all the games that I've played so far on my channel. Because this is the one that started it all out for me. No doubt it's also the one that started it out for all of you as well, uh, watching this. <laughs> or most of you, I should say. But uh, yeah, like uh, because I was able to get into the Fire Emblem franchise, uh, it influenced me to create my own video game franchise based off of Fire Emblem. And you know what? Like, that's just something that I'll always forever be grateful, right? So hopefully I can get uh, my own game out within the next couple years. But, uh, you know, that's down the line. Let's focus completely on this game, right? We're going to be doing a Hector Hard Mode Ranked Run as well as Lin Mode because I want to show off as much of the game as I possibly can, right? If I could squeeze uh, Ellie Wood Mode in there, I would. But uh, I don't feel like playing Ellie Wood mode all the way to the end basically to show off one different chapter so <laughs> but uh you know that's fine and uh i really love this intro by the way like uh i really like how that little shot of all the eight heroes and if you know the descriptions of uh based off the descriptions that you get in fe6 you would know who's who in the zoo of all these heroes right that's one thing you can say about this game like the presentation is phenomenal phenomenal and well the story is dog shit <laughs> but the gameplay is solid so there you go two out of three for me that's uh more than passing so and speaking of the presentation you know gotta let the the beat build up so my god this uh this theme is so phenomenal <laughs> uh but uh you know i'm not gonna you know i'm not gonna keep you guys waiting either so uh, that's kind of my thing here is that i like to get through the games as fast as possible not necessarily that i'm rushing everything or like uh that that uh, I'm trying to like uh, get through the game uh, because I, I want to just you know tear right through it. But like uh, no, like I don't want to waste your guys' time. That's my big thing here is that I want to give you the the best possible quality content in the least amount of time because your guys' time is very precious to me. You know, <laughs> time is literally the biggest, uh, the most precious thing we have on this planet. So let me not waste your time. Like if you're here for this uh, let's play, thank you very much for watching me. And yeah, like let me <laughs> let me entertain you <laughs> to the best of my ability. So, oh uh, yeah. Speaking of which, of course, you know the there you go. Like our first uh, little like uh, background right there. Like uh, th those little like uh, cutscene backgrounds. They're so they're so well made, man. Whoever made them, uh, man. Like I would love to hire them for my game because uh, no one told them to go that hard. <laughs> like especially for like a, a scene that's only gonna like be. Uh, up for like a couple seconds at best or might even be skipped over by people because like they don't want to see it so there you go but uh anyway here's uh here's lynn that's our first ever waifu of fire emblem you know <laughs> but uh you know oh and that, oh, that's right they do do that thing i forgot you know like where lynn is uh peering into my soul right now so that's uh it's pretty cool <laughs> uh i'm not down for all that like isekai bullshit you know so like <laughs> uh, for me it, i i don't really it doesn't really matter like uh but i guess i guess to some degree it is uh a lot of people do like to envision themselves in video games um don't get me wrong i, I do as well you know like i sometimes feel like uh, i i kind of like uh, do role play a little bit like uh where I like to roleplay, like in the sense that like uh, when I'm playing Mario or Zelda and stuff, like I, I like to sometimes envision myself as Link and Mario. And sometimes, I'm not gonna lie, like this was actually pretty cool like to like get me invested into the story a little bit more when I was younger. So, hey, you know what? Fair enough. Uh, it's actually a very clever smokescreen for how bad the story is too. So, uh, I'm, I'm pretty sure they didn't even think about that. But uh, obviously, no one, <laughs> they didn't think like, oh, this story is dog shit, run it, right? Like. <laughs> <laughs> obviously not but i mean that's just what it turned out to be right and this is actually a really good distraction so hey and actually this is a very good uh, exercise too for like if you're very socially awkward like just uh <laughs> just learn uh how to look people in the eyes by uh you know loading up this game and looking up at uh hector elliewood and lynn in the eyes there you go you'll definitely build some confidence and uh you know gotta change it up a little bit you know i hope you guys like the new background that i put on uh, I didn't want to keep it like generic, uh, so I, I, I went with a green color. Like uh, I really like it. Like uh, I like the background of everything. I feel like the co colors mesh pretty well, and it's a little warm and inviting too. So uh, I like the contrast. It's not too like uh, it, it, like I, I feel like it blends well. So hopefully you guys like it too. So <laughs> you know uh, I didn't want to keep everything the same for like the sake of uh, you know just keeping everything fresh. I want to give everything its own little identity. So and uh, yeah, like I. You know, this this is a strategy I like to use for this first chapter. Like, this first chapter is really not that hard. In fact, if you really want to, like, uh, 
you know lower the hit rates too you can even go up on that mountain but i don't find it necessary so hopefully lynn doesn't cuck me here and gets hit twice <laughs> that would really suck uh and of course it's bad of the meme you know <laughs> like it's funny like uh how, oh of course she gets hit on the first uh on the first hit so Hopefully she dodges the, the second one because I really don't want to like uh, restart <laughs> or like I'm probably just going to reload like with like uh, with me actually succeeding. So, OK, nice, nice. Thank you, Lynn. <laughs> wow. Like I, I was not like I was already resound to just restarting and being like, OK, whatever. I'll just cut in here. Like, that's just my luck. Right. Like that's what's going to happen in this uh, ranked run. But no, nah, luckily, uh, Lynn, uh, you know, oh, no, no, she, she'll get her payback right now because she's not going to level up strength. I'll tell you that. She'll just like, uh, she's like, don't worry, I got you, clown. Like, I'll dodge his attack, but like, uh, I'm gonna use up all that good RNG to not get a, a level up uh, in strength, of course. <laughs> but she got defense, so uh, I, I, uh, a bulky Lin? Like, <laughs> that's a, that's a thing, right? <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, man, Lin, please. Like, this is not a good start. <laughs> I need you to have a lot of strength. I've been awake, girl. I'm I'm always woke. <laughs> Lynn, don't be don't be disrespectful, girl. Come on. Like I just got done playing FE6, and you're gonna tell me that little like battle. That's not even like uh, you're lucky FE8 exists because I would say this is the worst tutorial like map of all of Fire Emblem. But uh, you know FE8 is even worse. So like that's uh kind of tragic, but not as tragic as uh, Lynn's backstory. Hey, <laughs> that was a nice little clean segue. <laughs> I shouldn't be laughing at this, but like, uh, uh, well, uh, it's kind of sad because like I feel like they really wanted you to invest in Lin a lot. And don't get me wrong, I, w I was very sympathetic towards Lin when I first played this game. But like, since there was no follow up and she got thrown to like the wayside uh, in the main uh, campaign, I was like, oh okay, I guess uh, Lin ain't shit. But uh, obviously, I did like the the moment where we reunited with her. But uh, you know, that's down the line. So there you go. Oh, th yeah, oh, thanks. Uh, <laughs> I wasn't even like, I was just talking shit about you, but uh, hey, you know, I'm glad I made you feel better. <laughs> there you go, Lynn. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, you won't become stronger by not leveling up strength. That, that's uh, that's for sure. So, yeah, I'll train you really good, Lynn. Don't worry. Like, uh, I'll, uh, what is it? I'll, uh, what, what's the, what's the strat? Like, uh, I forget. <laughs> I'll burn some RNG so that you can get a uh, good strength level ups. There you go. I'm, I'm your master strategist, Lynn. You'll be my, uh, well... You'll be, you'll be my warrior for sure. So uh, there you go. Like, uh, thank you very much for watching. Give me a like if you enjoy what I do. And I'll catch you on the next part. Take care.